Argentina will have a new leader in charge on Thursday. This man, center-right Buenos Aires mayor Mauricio Macri, who will put an end to 12 years of the Kirchner family rule. But this transition of power will be all but quiet. Welcome to Argentina's latest political drama. For the first time in decades, a sitting president, leftist Cristina Fernández de Kirchner, is refusing to attend the ceremony of a president-elect. That's because the two presidents couldn't agree on when or where the change of power will take place. Cristina Fernández wants Mauricio Macri to be sworn in here, in Congress, like she did. But Mr. Macri says he wants to do it here, in Casa Rosada, the presidential palace, like many other Argentine leaders. Mrs. Fernandez even accused her successor of abusing her during a phone conversation about the transition, something Mr. Macri denies. He shouldn't treat this day as his private birthday party. I'm not willing to suffer in silence this personal and public mistreatment anymore. He is a man and I am a woman. He shouldn't treat me that way. These people are gathering to give a proper farewell party to their leader. They believe Mr. Macri has been disrespectful with President Cristina Fernandez, a woman they regard as the champion of poor. But others didn't take this presidential row so seriously. Ooh, 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 ooh. This video made by an Argentine comedian about the phone conversation between the two leaders has gone viral. Y usted sería tan amable y disculpe la molestia, ¿no? De vuelta, sin poder dejar la clave, mover la clave. La clave es mía hasta el 10. The new Argentine leader has promised a new era of change and reconciliation, but this presidential soap opera suggests the times of division in Argentina are far from over.